Welcome back, everybody. Good stream tonight if you like Castlevania, and I know a lot of you do. I still need to fix my camera. I didn't, <clears throat> I didn't uh, swap, the, swap the camera around yet. Give me a sec. There we go. All right. So it's going to be a good show tonight, regardless. We'll get into the what's going down here in a little bit. Once we get some people in here. What did you play it on the PS4? Did you do the hidden weapons, emerald weapon and ruby? Nice. is not impossible. I did it. straight to the ending. You have to save it right before him. Which makes sense, whatever. 
if you stream it from the PS4, they don't they don't allow you to show the ending. They'll block it. And I've streamed it on my original PlayStation many times on here. All right, so tonight is all about Castlevania. You know I love Castlevania. We're listening to Rondo Blood on vinyl right now. What's going on, Yars? So. Konami's coming out with three collections. One of them's out already on the Switch, on the Xbox, and on the PlayStation. It's Konami Classic Arcade Games. They do have Haunted Castle, which is a Castlevania. Then uh, they're coming out with a Castlevania one, and then they're coming out with a Contra one. And I want to go through all the games that should have been on there as far as Castlevania goes. I don't remember, no. Um, I think I used Vincent... Red 13 and uh, Cloud, I believe. But there is a way to do it with uh, with uh, um, Kate Sith with the Lucky Sevens. So check this out. This is what is going to be on the collection. And I'm really impressed that Castlevania Bloodlines will be on there. So check this out. I'm definitely going to get it. I just don't know if I want it on the PS4 or on the Switch. May 16th, it'll have the original trilogy, Castlevania 4, Super Nintendo, and the first two for Game Boy. It has Kid Dracula, the Famicom version, not the Game Boy version, and Castlevania Bloodlines. So tonight, I'm going to focus on the games that should have been on there, not the games that are showing. Tonight is all about games that should have been included in that collection. They're missing the most rare one, the third one, and I have it. I'm going to stream it for you guys. It's called Castlevania Legends. You star uh, Sonia Belmont. She was supposed to be in the Sega Dreamcast game, and it got canceled. But yeah, let me go grab a drink quick. I also have my PSP hooked up to this TV. My PSP is not modded. That is the actual game. I'm going to be playing that as well. Rondo of Blood and many other good Castlevanias going on man she's the only female Belmont I don't know about that I can bust out my Castlevania book if you want to learn about your Castlevania though <laughs> you got a whole book about that and then Oh, thanks, man. Yeah, you like that? Also, last but not least, happy 420, everybody. If you're celebrating, make sure you uh, use your head. Oh, yeah, you're asking about those floor mats. I could show you it to you. I gotta find it. Hold on. Check out the floor mats, man. I got a lot of Castlevania books, man. What's up, Duber? So it's gonna be a good night tonight. Right now we're listening to Rondo of Blood. What's going on, Conan? You want me to find that Castlevania book? I think it's over here. Man. All right, the book I was referring to is this one right here. 
Hardcore Gaming 101 presents Castlevania. Everything you need to know. All the games that weren't released as well. Um, it's in full color. Make sure you guys check it out, dude. It's, it's amazing. I'm going to be going over the games that should have been included in Konami's upcoming Castlevania collection. Not the games that are on it, the games that should have been on it. I'm going to show you the list right now. Right here. Comes out on May 16th. And happy 420, everybody. Yeah, it's a really cool book. I've got lots of Castlevania. Trust me, man. You guys haven't seen the half of it on the streams. It's going to have Castlevania Bloodlines, which is awesome. Castlevania Bloodlines will also be on the Sega Genesis Mini that's coming out in September. Don't worry, Dart. They said that they would be doing just one Castlevania. Yeah, cool. They just released Symphony of the Night and Rondo on PS4, though. I'm on PS4. But yeah, that book. If you want to learn about Castlevania, get this book, for real. Trust me. It's a good read. This is the game right here, Castlevania Legends. This is the only Game Boy one that they didn't throw in the collection so far. And Alucard's in the game. Sonya Belmont was going to be in the Castlevania Resurrection for the Dreamcast, and they do have stuff about it in here. Here's Castlevania Bloodlines, Symphony. It would have been right after Symphony, or actually 64. Circle of the Moon. All the good Game Boy Castlevanias are in here. Even those goofy uh, phone games, the Wii Fighting game. Castlevania Judgment. Castlevania Rebirth. A lot of people wanted that on there. It's a remake of the original Castlevania one. I'm gonna I'm gonna play that for you guys tonight on the on the Wii. And I'll be playing uh, the Japanese version of Symphony and Rondo of Blood tonight. This is the com Castlevania comic. Show you some of the back covers here. Yeah, it's a really cool book, man. For real. I got another one from the same people. Yeah, that's really cool. It's worth its its weight in gold in that alone because that game's expensive. But yeah, definitely some cool Castlevania stuff. Yeah, that one. Yep, I got that one. The author it was in my stream. I know the, the author to... He was uh, in charge of a Splatterhouse and Castlevania website. Yep. That's another good one, yeah. The Guide to Retro Horror, yeah, this one's really good. It's just called uh, Hardcore Gaming 101 Presents. Castlevania. You can find it on Amazon. Yeah, I might get that on the on the um, on the Switch. Maybe. I'm on the fence if I want it on Switch or the PS4. All the clock towers, all the similarities. This looks crazy. How many generations? A lot. There is a timeline somewhere in here. Uh, timeline 141. There's your timeline right there. Take it in. Very first one is Lament of Innocence on PS2. And the very last one was Castlevania Dawn of Sorrow for the Game Boy Advance. Yep, because Konami's releasing a Castlevania collection. I'm playing all the ones that should have been on there. And if you don't like it, you can fuck off.
1094. <laughs> Yep, I, I played that one for the PS2 right there. Lament of Innocence. You've seen it. That's the very first Castlevania, technically. Well, now they have Lords of Shadow, which is a whole different ball game. I don't like it, and then go watch some random ass drunk on Friday night instead. Because I really don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Do I look like I care? I don't. It is 420 though. I'm gonna turn this shit up. But yes, this is the Castlevania collection coming out. I'm just listening to this one side and then we're gonna jump right into a bunch of bunch of Castlevania all night. Lots of good ones, lots of them that are expensive as hell, dude. What's up, Frankenstein? Lament is awesome. Yeah, I really want that on vinyl. They didn't release that on vinyl yet. All the Castlevania vinyls that they released, I have them. Right now I got the PSP going. I'm gonna be playing the Wii. What's up, Murdoch? Well, first we're gonna play some uh, Game Boy on the Game Boy Player on the GameCube. This vinyl side is almost done. And there's the chain shout. And it is 420, let me find my shit. I'm definitely looking forward to the collection though. I'm gonna get it, even though I have all those Castlevania games already. I can never get enough of them. I just wish I could stream my, my DS and my 3DS games for you guys. Yeah, dude, I know lots of people in the UK. <coughs> They're just not on right now. Isn't it like super early in the morning right now for you? Probably. I don't think they're going to, Grim. I really don't think they're going to. They would have done that with uh, Symphony of Rondo Blood, but they didn't. Yeah, 613, a lot of people are waking up on a Saturday morning, they're, they're, it's their one day to sleep in, so that's, you're, right now you probably are the only one. Amsterdam, awesome, hell yeah, cheers, it's 420 here, which is like a stoner's holiday. Okay, let's see. So once again, tonight's stream is all dedicated to games that should have been on this. Yeah, see Grimm's in there too. No, I know a lot of people. Like I said, uh, my buddy UK Bulldog, also, uh, what's up Big Buds? They're coming out with this on May 16th. Um, it's really cool that they have Genesis Bloodlines on there. Kid Dracula for the Famicom, which is ja Japan's version of Nintendo. I do have the Game Boy version of Kid Dracula and I have the third Game Boy game, which is only, it's missing on here. That one's really expensive. Nice. Awesome. But yeah, this vinyl's almost done. This side anyway. I think it is done. Nope, one more song. But yeah, I highly recommend this book, you guys. If you like Castlevania just a little bit, or if you wanna catch up on anything. 
the cost $20 no, I might get it on the switch tonight Live just so I can show you haunted castle. I can play that game on my CRT. It's super difficult That's their controversial Nintendo power cover. It was the second issue and they got a lot of hate mail from moms because he's holding Dracula's decapitated head Yeah, yeah, I'm the same way I support it. Here's haunted castle. I'm warning you right now They do have this for the Konami classic arcades don't buy it just for this game. This game, it looks cool. Yeah, it's Castlevania. It's hard as shit. If you think Cuphead is hard, think again. If you think Dark Souls is hard, think again. If you think shit, any of those games are hard, you haven't played Haunted Castle. This shit will make you rip your hairs out. And it doesn't matter if you have a whole satchel of quarters either. It doesn't matter. You can only have, I think, three continues on certain versions of it. And it is hard. That's an understatement. Here for channel text. What's gonna what's going on here? Castlevania, all night. Castlevania right here. Yeah, my no death run? I'll try it. I will try. But yeah, if I get the Castlevania um, game, Haunted Castle, on the Konami thing, do you want it streamed tonight on that TV on the Switch, or should I do it on a separate thing on my PS4 so I can actually stream it? Or should I leave it up to a vote? I can let you guys vote. Same with the Castlevanias. Do I get it on PS4 or do I get it on the Switch? If I get it on the Switch, then I can uh, stream it like this. If I get it on the PS4, it'll be a legit stream, you know? gonna bust out all my Castlevania shit that would make a big mess but let's just say I love that shit <sighs> thank you all right now the vinyl's over so now it's time to game all right here we go yeah see I'm playing the game the actual Game Boy game is in there that's the Game Boy player on the GameCube like I tell you every time if you get a Game Boy player Make sure it has the Game Boy Player disc, otherwise it's garbage. It's a paperweight. So here we go. Oh shit, I gotta have some volume on for that. Oh, thanks man. Yeah, I did a lot. There's a lot of Castlevania ones that I don't own anymore. So maybe I'll do a little slideshow later on since this is a Castlevania stream. Alright. Yep, every game I t play tonight will be Castlevania related. Guaranteed. So this is the third Game Boy game. It's very expensive. It's called Castlevania Legends. Well, thanks, Grim. Legend. You should paint that on the power cover. Yeah, dude, that would be cool. 1997, I was 17. Standard. Here we go. 
よ。Yeah, this is the Game Boy player on the GameCube, yeah. I'll give you a tour if you're、uh, new. With the light of hope. There she is, Sonia Belmont, man. This game goes for a pretty penny just for the cartridge alone. But the game's not that good, I'll show you. I'm just surprised they didn't include it. They got the first two. But the music is good. Castlevania's on vinyl, man. I'll show you all of them in a little while. Expensive as fuck. And you're gonna play as this chick in the Sega Dreamcast Castlevania that they ditched. It was called Castlevania Resurrection. They talk about it in my book if you want me to show you. Oh, yeah, I'll help, man. Anyway, one for you, one for me, one for you, one for me, two for you, one for me. <laughs> ah! Just drop right down on top of your head. The music's not bad, though, for being on Game Boy. Oh, shit, I wasn't supposed to hit that. No! It's a trap. Is, it's a trap.
you don't want to hit that candle. It's not the only Castlevania to have traps that are in candles or in walls. Another rare one that's worth a pretty funny penny is uh, uh, Castlevania... What is it called? I don't know. It's on PlayStation. I have that one too. That one. It's a remake of the original Castlevania. I'm going to try to finish that one for you guys tonight too. Oh, he landed right on my head. Like he just didn't care. Castlevania Legends. Yep, I only have the cartridge for it. It's right here. See? Not emulated. That's the Game Boy version, man. It's called Castlevania Legends. No, I was talking about the Castlevania um, Resurrection for Dreamcast that they canceled. It was going to star Sonya Belmont. Oh, you're talking about the PlayStation one? I have it. It's, uh... Shit, I did it again. I just wanted to show you the third one, which is not in the collection. It's strange that they have the first two Game Boy games, but not the third one, that one. Oh, uh, yeah, Lament of Innocence. I've been uh, streaming that. I made it past the Succubus. I still got a lot more to do. But that one, I don't know if I'll play that one tonight. We'll see. Um, what else? Oh yeah, they have uh, they have Kid Dra What's cool is they have Kid Dracula, but it's the Famicom version. Um, I only have the Game Boy version, so that's pretty cool. When I get that Castlevania collection, I'll be able to play that one. But I could show you the uh, the Game Boy version right here of Kid Dracula. It's pretty good. It's definitely a Castlevania game. I forgot who it was, but they told me that it wasn't a Castlevania game, and then. I had to lay down some research on them. Hey, there he is. Cheers, man. But yeah, tonight I'm doing all the games that should have been on that Castlevania um, collection. It's coming out May 16th. I'll show you the picture one more time. I gotta flip this vinyl over anyway. I got my new Chain Chomp lamp, dude. Check it out. <laughs> That's badass, dude. But yeah, there he is. Refresh this. Flip this. If you haven't seen the Rondo of Blood uh, Dracula X split vinyl, I'll show it to you, man. It's badass. I'm actually going to show you all my Castlevania vinyls eventually tonight. Yeah, dude. It's on there. So this is the uh, Rondo of Blood side. This is the Dracula X side when you open it. Dracula X. Rondo of Blood. Look at that. Isn't that cool? And there's Maria as a little girl. I can finish Rondo of Blood. I, I'll let you guys pick if you want me to finish it with Richter Belmont or little girl Maria. Vampire Hunter. She grows up to be Maria in Symphony of the Night. And I can play as her growing up in the Japanese version of Symphony. It's actually called Dracula X, Nocturne of the Moonlight. Very confusing because there's three different Dracula X's. <clears throat> okay. So as promised, here's the picture. It's coming out soon. I'm going to get it. Probably on the Switch. gonna have Castlevania 1, 2, 3, 4, the first two on the original Game Boy, Castlevania Bloodlines, which is worth a lot more than what they're asking for that whole collection, and the rare 
Kid Dracula for the NES version of the Japanese one. Nice, three copies. I'll take, dude. I, I want that one. Vampire Kiss. Yeah, dude. Dracula X. I don't know, man. The, he he walks like he has to take a shit. Like he has a stick up his ass. The controls are so stiff. After playing it, it you know, it's like a wannabe uh, Rondo of Blood. So, I'm not a big fan of Dracula X. I have it. It's right here, and it's in really nice condition. Like the, the label. I mean, yeah, that shit's not cheap either. So that's another one that I could show you anyway, just to be played. But now I'm going to show you the Game Boy version of, of uh, Kid Dracula. I'll just do, like, the first level. But, yeah, that's awesome, man. The Castlevania 4s. Are the boxes, like, in good shape, or are they kind of crushed? What does your cover of uh, 4 look like? Is it the, J the Japanese version or the ours? Or is it different? It, it would be in my book. It has all the different artwork. I could look it up if you want. Yeah, I'm going to play a lot of them, dude. If we're doing the Castlevanias tonight, yeah. I'm going to play a lot of them that people probably haven't played a lot of. This is actually a legit game too for a Game Boy. What is the artwork different I mean for the PAL? So listen to the music, you'll hear that Castlevania in it. Thank you. 
I got Demon's Crest now, right here, Firebrand from Japan. Yeah, man. <laughs> got lots of him. We got lots of that. Uh...
Oh no! <laughs> yeah. Anyway, one more on the classic Game Boys. Uh, a lot of the Game Boy ones should have been on the collection. Um, you know, I even have the original Castlevania, but for the Game Boy Advance, it's basically just the NES version, so that doesn't count because that's on there. But I've got like a Raya of Sorrow for the Game Boy Advance, you know, the Circle of the Moon, all of them. Harmony of Dissonance. Yeah, dude, here we go. Really quick, like.
Yeah, it's on hard mode, yeah. What's up, man? Yeah, happy 420, man. Sure. Yeah, I'll show you what I'm doing. I can't pause my game, but right after this, I'll show you what I'm doing, man. Okay, man. Yeah, I'll check it out in a little bit. I would love to have that Nintendo Power with Simon's Quest on the cover. Holy balls, man. Yeah, man.
Nice. Yeah, I like a lot. There's some parts in the 64 one that are actually really cool. Some of the music is great, too. There's some parts that are just really stupid as well. It has its ups and downs. Second one is cool, you could be a werewolf man. There's death. I think something's funny. Gotcha! Well, wait, there's more. Now it's like playing Strider. Yeah, that part sucks. You can't run or you can't jump. That was the hardest part of the game. I remember that. I was stuck on that for a little while. I liked the, the uh... The hedge maze was cool and the final boss was badass. He fought Vlad the Impaler, then Dracula, and then the giant dragon out in the desert. It actually looked really good. This is the final boss right here, Dracula. He's got two forms. Let's take him out. Here we go. If I don't die. This is on hard too, in this mode. It's a new lap record! Yeah. Dracula Raid. Oh, thank you. And that was the end. The castles crumbled.
But no, man, what I'm doing, I'll show you, is uh, next month Konami's releasing a Castlevania bundle on the PlayStation 4, on the Xbox One, and on the Nintendo Switch. And I will show you this collection. I'm playing games that should have been on the collection. Tonight, all Castlevania. I also have Castlevania on vinyl over here. Tons of Castlevania on vinyl, actually. show you here's a picture actually gonna shut that off put on some more tunes so yeah it's pretty cool it comes with the original trilogy on Nintendo then it the Super Nintendo one obviously the first two on the original Game Boy missing the third one though Castlevania Bloodlines the only Sega Castlevania game which goes for a lot of money and Kid Dracula only for the Famicom Famicom Japan it's a, it's a good collection but uh, there's a lot of a lot of cool Castlevania games missing that's what I want to show you guys tonight I'm gonna switch things up here of Dissonance for the Game Boy Advance. That's what that was. It should have achievements. There's a, there's a Konami arcade collection out right now. But uh, I don't have it. I might get it on the Switch. It does have Haunted Castle on it, which is a Castlevania game. But it's very difficult. Alright, now I gotta hook up some other shit. the Castlevania vinyls, which one you guys want? What do you want to hear? I gotta put that back in the plastic. We're listening to Rondo of Blood right now. two of them like that dude there's one uh, for the Game Boy Advance and there's one for the uh, DS loose card of bloodlines I'll check nice yeah, bloodlines is a good one I would play it but it's included in the collection it's also gonna be on the Sega Genesis mini which I pre-ordered comes out in September, it's gonna be a while. Alright, I'm grabbing more Castlevania vinyls. 
Let me grab... Over here. one I can't find. It's got to be over here. But yes, there is another one where you can play a solo. It's the, the six player one. I have that as well on the Xbox 360. There it is. this glorious side a is the nes version side b is the famicom version or side a and b is nes and side c and d is famicom i mean but yeah it's a cool looking vinyl it's dracula's curse harmony of despair yeah that one played the shit out of that man me and my buddy used to just speed run all the levels on hard just to try to grind and get loot That's a fun game though. picture doesn't do it justice at all. Hope you're all enjoying the Castlevania Marathon though. It's not over. Alright man. Yeah, man, I got it. Yeah, but I, I got something cooler for you, Yars. You'll flip when you see this, dude. 
I can only think of three things that I own that are mislabeled. Factory mislabeled, and uh, Strider 2 is one of them. I'll show you what I mean. I would totally play it tonight, but it's not Castlevania, man. I can't do it. But I do have it. I love Strider. What do you think of the new Chain Champ? Chain Chomp lamp. <laughs> See that? A whole bunch of times fast. <clears throat> I'm gonna need my memory cards here. But yeah, no, I gotta show you something really cool about Strider 2. Castlevania Chronicles goes for a lot of money. This is one that should have been on the collection. It was not. It's a remaster of the original Nintendo version. I'm gonna be playing that for you guys. Oh yeah, uh, Strider 2. Where is it? Right here. Here's Strider 2. You open it up, and when you pop this in, this is supposed to be the original Strider arcade game, it's not, it's mislabeled, this is actually Strider 2. And then if you pop in the Strider 2 disc, guess what it is? It's the original arcade game. So these are mislabeled, 100%. But yeah, here we go, we're doing more Castlevania all night. I'm showing you some rare ones, man. Um, some of them are worth a very pretty penny as well. This one too, Dracula X Vampire's Kiss. Right now we're listening to Dracula's Curse. I could speed it up. Yeah, I'm just about ready, you guys. Just about ready. I'm not sure how much this goes for, but this is a, on original PlayStation. Black disc. It's a nice copy. I just gotta find the right memory card. I think it's this one. I'm gonna try to finish it for you guys too. Well, I'll show you the the alternate Dracula. It's pretty cool. Yeah, cheers, man. Oh, thanks, man. I got lots of Castlevania shirts, man. I got a hoodie too. It says, "What a horrible night to have a curse." Let me show you a picture of uh, some of the other paintings that I have, and I can show you more. I've got tons of Castlevania on vinyl. I got Castlevania for days, man.
But yeah, I like the shirt too. Oh, here's my one of my oil paintings. It's 3D. See the whip and the racks. Nice. You still haven't sent me pictures, Conan. I want to see all your uh, figurines and stuff. You got to do that. Make sure you guys join my community. I'm just one person shy of 300 on the PlayStation 4. It's called Game Dungeon Productions. You can't miss it. Make sure you guys join. That's where I update what I'm doing on the streams and shit. I do want to get the uh, Castlevania amiibos that are going to be coming out. Okay, good. Let me see if I can find some of these older pictures here. Here's one. This shirt looks familiar too. Oh, thanks, man. Okay, cool. That's Randy Cry. Yeah, I'm playing it right now, man. Right after I show you something amazing, that is. Yeah, it's gonna be a good night, man. If you like Castlevania, I'm gonna be playing Castlevania Rebirth, which is the remaster of the original Game Boy version, which is awesome. It was only available on the uh, Wii eShop. Now it's gone. I'm gonna be playing that as well. I'm gonna be playing Rondo of Blood. I'll do the first level, and then I'll do the last level. I'll show you the end. Hopefully I can finish it again. <coughs> but yeah, let's kill the Dracula's curse for now. It's just about over, but... I got Castlevania um, on vinyl for days. I even have Castlevania on my uh, glass coffee table. I'm going to be making a Castlevania collage on a gothic cross too. Right, here we go. This is not emulated whatsoever. Original Castlevania Chronicles disc. Not sure about my memory cards whatsoever, but here we go. Uh, like I said, I'll try to do the first level and the last level, and then we'll move on. Like a champ, my trusty old PlayStation. Let's see if it finds one. There's no save data. No, I don't want to end it. Check this one then. It's got to be this one.
I don't even remember. Maybe eight each. I still got Resident Evil stickers on some of them. There's Resident Evil 2. Final Fantasy 7. All the outlook. See if I can load my game here. Actually, I said I was doing a, the first level first anyway. Special options. Oh yeah, there's interviews and shit you can watch.
<laughs> yeah, I did, man. I'm uh, I'm more excited about the Mandalorian uh, series. That looks amazing, dude. But yes, I did see it. I'm gonna be doing a epic Star Wars stream on May the fourth. I hope everyone uh, joins on that day, May fourth. Make sure you guys follow me. All the classic Star Wars video games. All day, all day. deals probably working man but that was the first level now I'm gonna go to the final level I should be able to do a hard reset here yeah Wish me luck. This is the final level. It's pretty difficult. <laughs> Here we go. I would want it for a year at least.
get my ass kicked here. Yeah, you can come visit. You just gotta let me know. Amazon Prime has a great horse selection, lots of old stuff. Yeah, we're actually gonna be getting that for a year soon, so hopefully I can I can uh, keep my streams longer on uh, pri on uh, Twitch. I mean, yeah, I'm dead. We gotta get some fried thirteens going soon. I didn't see that one. I died. This part's hard with the giant bats. And then it's not even close to being the end yet. Dracula. I gotta get there first. These giant bats are no joke.
cool. Looks pretty demonic. Like he looks like Morbius, kind of. But yeah, he does. Uh, he does change forms too. So just like the original cast, of the classic. <laughs> show you next is even better. Oh, thanks, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. That's another Castlevania done. That should have been on the Konami collection. That was Castlevania Chronicles. This game is not cheap for the original PlayStation. We still got tons of great Castlevania to come. I'm not even get. I'm just getting warmed up, man. Make sure you guys join the PlayStation 4 community, Game Dungeon Productions. Range mode. If you do original mode, it looks more like classic Simon Belmont, and I'll show you. Yeah, at least I tried. If you 
do a classic mode, he has brown hair. And it's a little bit different, not much, but... Yeah, that was Castlevania Chronicles. Alright, let's jump to near the end of this side. Let's go to side B, actually. Dracula's Curse. How was everybody tonight? Doing good, I hope. for a different uh, Castlevania vinyl here. Let's do... <coughs> Castlevania 4 next. <coughs> Ooh, it's foggy down here and creepy. What a horrible night to have 420. one of my random ass Castlevania paintings. good on the PlayStation camera. Thank you. I really wish there were a way for me to stream my DS and 3DS games off of a TV for you guys. I'd be able to stream all those cool Castlevania games. I wish, I wish, I wish. Okay, uh, let's see how much Java juice we got left here. Not much, not looking good. Let me ask, what's everyone's favorite Castlevania? Is it Symphony of the Night? Is it Castlevania 4? Dracula's Curse? What is it? 
Let me know. For real. I want to know. Is it the original? My personal favorite is Castlevania 4. I also have it on the 3DS, but it's not, uh, but it's not 3D, unfor unfortunately. I wish it were 3D, because that would have been awesome. There's Castlevania, nice. Castlevania 4, hell yeah. Dude, I can play the Lament of Innocence. I have it. Uh, whatever. They're, they're, they're... I don't know. They're not easy. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I mean, they're missing the third one. I know they don't like the third one in, like, the... The story, they took it out, it's not canon, but it's the only Castlevania where you play as a female Belmont. She was going to be in the Dreamcast one called Resurrection and they, they canned it before it was finished. But, I don't know. I'm playing games that I thought should have been on there, that could have been on there. I played Castlevania Chronicles, I played uh, uh, Harmony of Dissonance, I played, uh, what else? Um, oh, I played Kid Dracula for Game Boy. When did they add the small girl? To, that's in the Rondo of Blood, man. I'm playing that tonight. I have three different versions of Rondo of Blood. One of them's on the PS4 now. It's awesome. But I actually, I'm going to play the PSP version. I have my PSP hooked up to my HDTV, so it's all ready to go. Showing you some Castlevania art I've done over the years. Shadow man, I did a lot of Lords of Shadow paintings. Oh, thank you for your anyway. I got plenty more. Lords of Shadow 2, just not the, the stuff in the future. That was kind of lame. I have two different versions of uh, Mirror of Fate as well. Oh, I got this too. It's pretty badass. I'll show you. Yeah, I can see it. It was fine. That's such a good record during Dracula's Curse. Okay, uh, oh yeah, I was gonna show you this. Oh, this big bastard. This is 
just a poster. It's too big. That's awesome, dude. Yeah, I like it. I like all of them like that. I'll have to jam it soon. Just not on Castlevania night, if you know what I mean. I will play Infested Beneath version, though. Castlevanias, man. I do have four, though. I'm going to throw it in quick, but we're going to watch something first. After I put this one away. Yeah, this is Dracula's Curse. This is the one that is based off of uh, the Netflix series, animated series. You wish they put all games in Super Nintendo. What do you mean? You mean the Super Nintendo Classic? You can mod it, man. I got I got Castlevania for days, so I'm gonna be showing you some of the more rare ones, man. Uh, I'm gonna be playing Castlevania Rebirth. You can't get that game anymore unless you mod it, emulate it. And I'll be playing the original version on the Wii. It's a remaster of the original Game Boy version, but yeah, it's on there. See the guy that holds the world record for largest video game collection. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I don't think my wife would uh, allow me to take over the house, but at least I have the game dungeon, man. I'm, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm good with that. Here's Castlevania 4. Right there's Medusa. I know you can barely see it, but it's pretty cool. Blood Splatter. The Sega Genesis Mini, by the way, you can pre-order it right now. And that, too, will have Rondo of Blood. I'm really surprised to see that Konami is releasing Rondo of Blood, finally, for other people to enjoy it. Because that game is not cheap at all. And you could only play it on a Sega Genesis. So you're going to be able to get it in this Konami collection next month. And you're also going to be able to get it in the Sega Genesis Mini. Now, I want to show you my favorite Castlevania introduction ever. Ever, hands down, this one. Would you say Rondo Blood is the best Castlevania? No. I would not. My favorite is Castlevania 4. I've said it thousands of times. So, no, I would not say it's the best one. But it's good, no doubts there. 
All right, I think I'm ready. Yeah, that would be cool. I want to see Sega come out with another console. That's what I want. Sega needs to come back. All right, so I literally have my classic PSP hooked up to my TV through the HD cords. So bear with me. I don't want you to see the intro just yet. <laughs> Yeah, man. You should see how expensive those games are. And I'm in the credits of Friday 13th, and one of my oil paintings is signed by the developers. Yep, I got Gears 1, 2, 3, and 4 now. I never played 4, but I, n I now have it. So. Yeah. Uh. Nah. Nah. <laughs> this is my favorite uh, Castlevania intro. It's the remake of Rondo of Blood, but then I'm going to play the original one. Hey, what's up, man? Accept. I accepted. Proto Man, what's going on, man? How you doing? Super Nintendo games? Some, yeah, it all depends on the game, man. Sometimes the Japanese versions are cheaper. Yeah, good, man. Cool. I just kind of started my week off, so doing a Castlevania marathon, nothing wrong with that. If anyone's new, let me know, I'll give you a tour right after this intro here. Then we're going to show you some Rondo of Blood. Yeah, do it. Come visit. Take you to a couple of video game shops, go to a couple arcades, and play a whole bunch of co op. Do it up, man. That's fucking awesome, dude. I love that intro. That looks like Vampire Hunter D right there. Dracula. Uh, what? <laughs> Did you even just watch what happened? They sacrificed that bitch. And the blood splattered all over Dracula's coffin. Oh man, okay, um, here we go. I could show you the original animated uh, intro. Yeah, see, we don't want to do that one. I gotta remember how to load this up. Here we go. Original game, Rondo Blood or Symphony. This is the version that we all got on the PlayStation 4. They changed some of the voice actors. They changed a lot of the dialogue. But the cool thing about it is there are things in the Japanese Sega Saturn version that they included in this one. So it's a very strange version of uh, Symphony of the Night. A lot of people hate it. They all love the original PlayStation version. But, uh, yeah, this wasn't bad. I did get the uh, uh, platinum for that one. But uh, everybody's wanting physical releases from Konami, and they're just not doing it. You know, would love a physical copy of this Castlevania collection right here. 
But here we go. This is the original Rondo Blood. You just saw the uh, remastered uh, intro. This one's uh, more anime than anything. Konami Code, I don't think, does anything. Try it again. Vor langer Zeit lebten die Menschen glücklich und zufrieden. I'm just gonna set my PSP down watches. Niemand bemerkte den Schatten der Sonne. Alright, now pay attention, world. Dracula is not a woman. <laughs> the fuck, man. Die Dunkelheit trübte ihre Sinne und das Böse fraß sich tief. Oh look, there's another woman on the table. And she's laying on top of his casket. Zu später Stunde kamen sie zusammen, um gemeinsam die Mächte der Finsternis mit ihrem sündigen Blut zu rufen, sie zu erlösen von ihrer sterblichen Existenz, den Anbeginn einer neuen Welt vor Augen. It's still a badass intro, though. Alright, here we go. This is me. You want me to finish this one, too? You want to see the end? I can finish it with Maria, as well. Let me see. So I don't have Maria unlocked in this one yet. I do on the PS4 one. Yep, I got the Adam Vinyl, man. They have it on the... Let's see if I can do this one. No, I don't want to quit. Alright, here we go. good.
Oh, he got me. I didn't even get to the second form. Damn. I'm gonna try again. I can do this. I have the Japanese version. I've got it. Check this out. It's a glow in the dark pen. Oh, thank you. No, I don't want to exit. Do you not have any desire? Yeah, man, I got it. <laughs> I got Castlevania for days. そして信仰によりそうか。そうか。<笑> <laughs> Those are the Castlevanias that will be available next month on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. Should 
play some Ocarina of Time music now for this. Yeah, that's the beginning of Symphony, yeah. Yes. You can also play as Maria, though. Little Maria. You have to unlock all the... All the chicks throughout the game. There's like five of them, I believe. But that was the end of Rondo of Blood. I'm also going to be playing Castlevania Rebirth, which is very, very uh, much seeked out. Like, people are harping the hell out of Konami to release that on the collection. Because you can't get it anymore. It was only available on the Wii shop, and it's closed now. And I'm going to play it on the Wii. Yeah, there's the the one that's not Castlevania, but it basically is, yeah. That one. Bloodstained. So I hope you like that little gameplay of Rondo. I love the uh, in the intro of the uh, remastered is cool, but I'm not a fan of the actual remastered version of the game itself. Let me check something here. There we go, it could be uh, Mar little Maria right here. I, I think I am. You can subscribe to me. Pretty sure I am. Okay. Oh shit, not activate the trap. That's what's that's bad. on the Castlevania is part four of vinyl. All right, and I gotta hook up a different uh, system. 
just in here. And it is Just uh, going to the rental store and seeing it. I rented it right when I saw it. Castlevania Nintendo Powers, man. Just not the classic Simon Simon's Quest one. All right, uh, I need to change up some systems. The Castlevania Chronicles did round to a blood. I did quite a few Castlevanias already, we're at two and a half hours in. In the Konami Arcade Collection, it has Haunted Castle on it. How would I need to play with your laptop, man? I got like two laptops and a computer upstairs. It's ready to go. Here's my stream. You are now inside the Matrix. I just gotta refresh it. Thank you, sir. Thank you for the offer for playing with your laptop. If you come visit, you can play with my 3DS if you'd like. Or whatever, an arcade game. Or this Mario Lite.
You weren't even that far away. Chicago's really not that far away. He'll play on the rug. Which one? There's a Super Nintendo one over there, too. Yeah, man, we'll do it up. <laughs> I'd bust out the Neo Geo, but unfortunately, they never made a Castlevania for Neo Geo. Because that's Konami. <laughs> I gotta hook up uh, my Wii now, my Wii U. It's hooked up, I just gotta make sure it's ready to go. HDMI and everything. Make sure you guys join my community on the PlayStation 4. It's Game Dungeon Productions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be playing some of that. A little spot for your memory card. That's so snazzy. I don't like it. So very thoughtful. Alright, I'm gonna kill the vinyl. Done. And let's start the gaming. Alright. So, I... I remember where I left off. I gotta figure out some of these rooms that I have marked on my map I have to start doing some backtracking with new abilities and whatnot so let's do that just for a little bit this is one Castlevania that definitely deserves to be released on vinyl I'm excited for it, man. I heard the VR is going to be uh, wireless for it. So, yeah, I'm excited for it. I got to change the contrast for this game. Where'd you put the remote control, man? It's all Undead's fault. He took the remote. There it is. Game Dungeon Productions, man. <laughs> That's what it is. In an era long past, as monarchies weaken, local feudal lords grew in power. The first knights simply protected their lords' domains. However, with the reforms of the late so 11th century, so, yeah. knights <laughs> became Everybody's protectors fault. of the peace. They valued courage and honor. And it's 420, by the way. Cheers, everybody. In, God's name. in this age, one company of knights was said to be invincible due to two men. Leon Belmont, a courageous man who feared nothing and whose combat abilities were second to none. And Matthias Kronkvist, a genius tactician. Yeah, that's 
Since the church is focusing on fighting heathens rather than monsters, it has forbidden unauthorized battles. Leon wants permission to sortie, but the church has no intention to grant it. Burn the witch. Matthias struggles from his sickbed and tells Leon that the appearance of the monsters is tied to a vampire who has a castle in the forest called. Yeah, <laughs> remind me what games you want me to get for you, the Mega Man ones. Send me a message with it. Castlevania on the timeline. Number one. <laughs> Unless you take into uh, Lords of Shadow into account. Check out the second one in VR, but I don't have the gun for it yet. I don't have the gun for VR. Conan, are you still in here, man? Conan still present?
Alright, man. Yeah, thanks for showing up. Got more hearts? Oh, yeah, I can take that off the map now. Um,
next game is Castlevania Rebirth. You can't get that game anymore. Yeah, uh, you were able to get it on the Wii back in the day, digitally only. until Wednesday so I'll be around and I'm going to be doing an epic Star Wars stream on May 4th if you guys like Star Wars video games then you're going to want to tune in
Castlevania Rebirth next on the Wii. That Castlevania game, you can't even get it anymore unless you emulate it. Save my game, I'm almost out of health here. Into the ghostly theater. Mr. Bobo Fatty, how the hell are you? Legendary Phantom, what's up? You need a tour of my game room? Good sir. I let you pick the next Castlevania vinyl. I can let you do that. Castlevania games that should have been included in next month's Capcom Castlevania collection. But yeah, uh, I said you could pick the next uh, Castlevania vinyl if you want, but you never got back to me. Let me know if you want. Castlevania, otherwise I'll leave it up to Mr. Frankenstein here. I'll show you exactly what I'm doing. I played a lot of good games already. I finished on stream tonight uh, Castlevania Chronicles for the PlayStation. Rondo of Blood on my PSP hooked up to my HDTV. Um... Played Kid Dracula for the Game Boy on the Game Boy Player for the GameCube. I also played Castlevania Legends, which is the third Game Boy game. They only have the first two on the... I'll show you the, the list of games that they're releasing next month. I'm going to get it probably on the Switch. But yeah, let me show you. And since no one's seeing not much, I'm going to change the vinyl here. Yeah, we, I played a lot of good Castlevania. I'm still going to do more, though. I'm going to be doing that Wii one. It's a remake of the original Castlevania Adventures for Game Boy. And it's pretty good. Good Castlevania game. Alright, so here it is. Let me drop the needle on Castlevania 4. I was going to change it to side C, but whatever. I 
Yeah, we already heard this side. Let me just shut that one off. Okay, uh... Oh yeah, the picture. Opinion on the PS5? Uh, I'm excited for it. <laughs> I don't have a 5K television or anything like that, but I'm still excited for it. It's inevitable. That's what it is. Well, yeah, here it is. Konami's Castlevania Collection. You get the original trilogy on the NES. You get Castlevania 4 for the Super NES. You get the first two original Game Boy games, Castlevania The Adventure, Belmont's Revenge, and, which is awesome, Castlevania Bloodlines, uh, which is a lot more money than that collection costs for $20. And what's cool is uh, that is the Famicom version of Kid Dracula, which is the Japanese NES. And that one I never played. I have the Game Boy version. So I played the Game Boy version. I'm playing games that should have been on this collection. Um, I'm pretty sure if that sells well, and I hope it does, that uh, they'll do more Castlevania collections. Obviously, the DS, 3DS, and all those other Game Boy Castlevanias. Um, a lot of people are bitching about Konami not having physical copies, but whatever. Um, at least they're doing something, so you gotta you gotta back them up. Otherwise, you know, money talks, bullshit walks. It's all about the money, unfortunately. Where's Castlevania for right here? But yeah, support if you like the Castlevania games. A lot of people are anti-Konami and shit and blah blah blah, but whatever. <laughs> Alright, let's go to side C on Castlevania 4. We're doing this all night. All night, buddy. I played a lot of good ones already. I also did Rondo of Blood. Now we're going to be doing Castlevania Rebirth after I take a leak and get a drink. So enjoy Castlevania 4 on vinyl. Say hello to the Chain Chomp Lamp. I'll be right back. PlayStation. That's not a good spot for that. I'm going to have to fill up my vape too. I'll grab that. It's 420. Duber Indica. 
to be sitting in the couch. In the couch. But yeah, I'll be right back. Castlevania 4 will be in the next uh, collection coming out, so I can't play it tonight. Otherwise, I'd do the Japanese version. Yeah, I'm gonna try out that Indica. So, yeah, happy 420, everybody. Castlevania, are you good on this one? I got Symphony of the Night as well. It's a good game. The next Castlevania I'm playing is really good. I hope you guys enjoy it. It's kind of kicking the teeth that you can't get it right now. I I'm sure there is a way to emulate it, but honestly, they should just do one big ass Castlevania collection on disc. That would be the way to do it. Without need for any updates. Make sure it's all on there from the go.
Yeah, I will. Yeah. That's why I'm doing Castlevania tonight. Castlevania collage, you guys, very soon. <coughs> Let me show you. safety strap on What's going on, man? I'm doing Castlevania games that should be in Konami's Castlevania collection. That's what I'm doing tonight. So I finished Rondo of Blood. I finished Castlevania Chronicles. Uh, I did a bunch of games, man. <laughs> and it's 420. All right, are you guys ready for this shit? I bet you are. You guys have been uh, waiting for this game. I know it. All night. Indica. In the couch. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's the ticket. Happy 420, Iowa, man. man. Dude, we gotta play some games, dude. Anything. I'll play anything with you, man. Marvel vs. Capcom 3, Fire 13, uh, Ghost Recon Wildlands. Yeah. 
I still got my guy. I still want to get him killed. Cheers, everybody. 420 Castlevania Marathon. fix the uh, contrast if I have to. I'll check it out. Or if you want it closer to the screen, let me know. That sucks. What is this tomfoolery? in the corner and blah, blah, blah. damn that sucks dude I still got my dude Level five. I warned you I said something to you I remember I was like are you sure you want to do that and then Riot was giving you shit I remember clear as day But he's not my guy, the Necro Dork. Big ass pot rolls, holy shit. Let me fix this a little bit. Yeah, dude, do it. Do it up. I gotta move my PSP. I don't wanna wreck it. I got it hooked up to this TV, man, my PSP. It's so tempting to play uh, Crisis Core, but I gotta do just Castlevania tonight, man. For real, it's a thing. Big-ass bat, man. Oh, shit. Fuck bat. When bats attack. This is Castlevania The Adventures Rebirth, Linger. You can't get it anymore. It was only available on the Wii. It's a remake of the original Game Boy Castlevania. I don't have the key for this, but we have the pot roast. Hmm. 
Yep. It's a remake of the original Game Boy one. I'm doing games that should have been on the Konami Castlevania collection coming out next month. They have the first two Game Boy games. I streamed the third one. Now I'm doing uh, this, Rebirth. Out of here. Look at that full moon. I get that to look better for you guys. better. Right? We got eyeballs. Oh shit. Bouncy eyeball. Badass game, it's a shame that they don't re release this for people to enjoy. It's like a lost treasure. And I'm here to share some of it with you. Might even get the uh, Konami one, the arcade one tonight on the Switch. Shit. 
shucks. Fiddlesticks. Dean Nabbit. Oh, I see the hidden block. I see it. I see it. Give me one of one of your seconds, kind sir, if you would be so kind. I got gotcha. you. I got you covered in the big in the game dungeon, man. I'm not sure when the Contra one releases, but it's after the Castlevania one, so probably summer, maybe? But it's cool, the Kid Dracula is the Famicom version, and it's really cool that they have Castlevania Bloodlines, because that game alone is worth three times the amount of what they want for that whole collection. People are bitching that they're not doing a physical copy, but... If you want to see more shit like that, you gotta dish it out, just to support them. Yeah, I have all those games, but I'm still gonna get it. Alright, here we go. Oh, fuck. The Merman look awesome in this one. Did you see that? That looks wicked. Got a key, key, key. Music's good too. Pot roast up in here. Get your pot roast. Well, we're going for a ride now. Do I really want to waste my key right here? Sure, why not? I got an extra life out of it. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, Bat. I see you. I see you, Bat. Here we go. I don't even have a sub weapon.
All right, Mr. Conan, thanks for stopping in, sir. And take care. Skinny poopy dude. This is Castlevania The Adventures Rebirth. It's a remake. You can only get it on the Wii. You can't get it anymore. On the Wii market. How many of what did I play? A lot. Good ones. And they're all not on the Castlevania collection, that's why I'm playing them.
this part is fucked. Ouch. That hurt. Oh, you got me. No, I died. Do it. Just the heads look awesome, man. That was really cool. Look at that. That's a really cool Medusa head. Oh shit. Come hither. Yeah, that's right. They really don't want to give me any health, do they? Oh shit. He's coming at me. Oh man. What the hell?
shit. There we go. This boss sucks. This is a good Vania game that you're watching. I'm not, I'm doing only Castlevania tonight though, man. All night. I got a couple different Ghostbuster games. Bitch. I need some meat. Give me some meat. Oh, this fucking part. There's the key. Yeah, happy 420, man. For reals. Ow. I'm almost dead. Shit. 
Got her. Oh, with one hit left. Yeah. That's what's up. Oh, it's not over, though. Shit. <laughs> what about Mega Man Soccer? Oh, the bat got me. The bat got me. Damn you, bat. I had my revenge. mind if I do. What about the arcade fight? The straight up uh, boss fights. Arcade Mega Man's are awesome. Rock Man. And this guy. I'm not having any of that. I'll be doing Mega Man 11 very soon, Iowa. You gotta help me out, man. Fill me in. I do have Lego Harry Potter, yeah. My little ones are just starting to read a, the books. Trying to get them into it, too. I wonder if I should take that other door. I destroyed the demo. I blew through the demo like it was no tomorrow. Look at this boss. Pretty awesome. I got a lot of Mega Man collections, man. For real. I just got Mega Man 11 physical copy. This is the Grim Reaper level.
That means we're pretty close to Dracula, man. I don't think there's a way to save your game. Shouldn't have went in there. I like it. I think they did a great job with Eleven. So I bought it, man. I watched Iowa play some of it. I gotta, I gotta get into X too. You can show me that one. It sure, it sure is a lot better than that. What was that one that they made? Mighty Number no. Nine, whatever. Yeah, that one. Terrible, it was free. Oh shit, we got eyeballs. We got chandeliers. Stabby guys. No pot roast for miles. Tower shit, man. Here we go. This is it. It's getting real now. It got real, real quick. I got a key. Where's the door? Oh shit. Here we go. There it is. Extra life. Yeah. That's what's up. Go, 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 go. Oh. Gotta fight that. I, need, I gotta get some health, man. Another extra life. Oh, shit, he fell on me? There goes more health, damn. I doubt it. They never are online. I wish they were. And I am almost dead.
Oh, no. Now where am I? Oh, good, I'm right here. That's not so bad. This time. Get me the hell out of there. for this if this is death man oh it's Frankenstein's monster man even worse What a bastard. No pot roast for miles. What's up, Yorn? I got my noodle whip. Eat noodle. That's better. Nice. 
Give me pot roast, damn it. I need the pot roast. Men's. But no wall meat, go figure. It's a nightmare. Oh, now it's my turn. Bastard. Almost dead.
No wall meat for me. This is the boss and I have no health. Pretty cool, man. Cool death. Now I have no hearts. To Dracula. Oh yeah, this is it. This is for all the beans. The marbles. Here we go. Let's do it. So no hot roasting for me. Oh shit! Die, monster. <laughs> As ever. The ally of worthless humans. I just did Castlevania Rebirth, Adventures Rebirth. Thank you. That's another Castlevania down. Oh, thanks, man. 
That's a cool one, man. I really like that one. There's a lot of different paths you can take, too, kind of like Rondo of Blood. Oh, thank you, thank you. Just in time for 420, you guys. On 420. It's a magical time. Magical! We're gonna jam some Castlevania tunes, man. I'm gonna blast some Symphony of the Night. Let me know what other Castlevanias you want to do. I do want to do some Lords of Shadow. I got to do it from scratch on the Xbox One. So let, let's do that next. After 420, we'll throw in some Lords of Shadow. I love that game. I love it. I love it. Bjorn, I love it. Do you want me to come over tomorrow, Bjorn? Or I guess we should stream from your place. I'm inviting myself over. <laughs> Lording Shadows, yes. Have you done Lament of Innocence? Yeah, I did play that earlier. Yep. We're at 4 hours and 12 minutes of all Castlevania linger. For real. All good Castlevanias. And I'm not done yet. I'm not done. I did uh, Rondo of Blood. I finished Rondo of Blood. I finished uh, Castlevania Chronicles. Stream from here. I'm a lonely loser. Oh, Bjorn. Would you like to save? What is there to save? Okay. Now we'll try it on normal. Classic. What's classic? I just want to see if it's any different at all. I don't think so. No, it's not. All right, well that was Castlevania Adventures Rebirth. It's pretty cool. I like it. I thought it was pretty cool, huh? One of the better Castlevanias I streamed tonight. Which one? Super Nintendo, Genesis, Saturn, what? Which one? Which one? How about myself? We got five minutes till 420 on 420. I know Bjorn's excited. Get excited. Iowa. Iowa. In the house. Iowa in the house. I was in the house.
Chain Chomp can't, it's freaking out that this is Castlevania, it's like, wow! Which Earthworm Gym 2 are you playing? Which one? What is it? Alright, I'm gonna hook up some other Castlevania shit that should be on there, but isn't. they had Castlevania on Dreamcast. If only. Speaking of the devil, man, look at that shit. It's 420 on 420, by the way, everybody. If you got it, light it up. I said I would do something of the night for 420, but I'm a little late. Yeah, yep. It starred uh, Sonia Belmont. She's in Castlevania Legends for. Look at that. On 420. I started my stream early. <coughs> I don't know how much this is going for now, but this is in really nice condition. <coughs> oh, yeah, dude. Oh my god. I'm gonna pass out early tonight. If I keep that up. Would you be mine? All right, here we go. Locked and loaded. All you know is a controller. Ugh. Yeah, happy 420, Mr. Iowa Hawks. Mr. Iowa Hawks. Oh, I suppose I should probably hook up my shit. That would probably help. Do you think? Yeah. 
heard deep space pirates talk about shit that you could do with your tongue. <laughs> The Middle Ages, the evil darkness had befallen the land. when it's 420 on 420. Look at them. He's freaking out. What? Timmy fell in a well. Thumbs up, remember? The music's really funky in this one. It's really got some funk to it. Yeah. Okay. It's like a wannabe Rondo of Blood. It's very mediocre. Control uh, type, not uh, I don't know. Controls are weird. Step, that's the
love it. I, I love doing that part over again for you all.
part reminds me of Castlevania 4. Want to see the uncensored Castlevania 4 intro? I know you do. You will not be getting this version when you get the Konami Castlevania collection. No, no, no. This one has blood and titties and crucifixes. See, look at the blood. <coughs> Yeah, look at it. Listen to it. The children of the night. I guess time for some Symphony of the Night music. And some uh, Dracula X Nocturne of the Moonlight. What do you think? Oh look, there's a crucifix that they took out of the American version. some uh, differences uh, the whip is very different the sound the whip makes Conversion sounds way better. As far as the whip. But I can't play this because Castlevania 4 is on the collection. I'm playing Castlevania games that should have been on the collections. And you know what time it is. You know what time it is. Pretty motivated for having all that indica, huh? <laughs> I 
I do know Japanese. I'm a Japanese master. Whoa. All right. I put this away without destroying shit. There we go. <clears throat> Castlevania 4 is away. This is a symphony of the night. What sweet music they make. <laughs> there it is. Symphony. I got all the different versions of Symphony, but those aren't opened. Yeah, dude, May the 4th. I got some good shit planned for May 4th. Castlevania stream still going strong. I'm not fading away. Okay. Um, I need this. You guys are in for a treat. I'm starting some classic games. And I want to start going through them all.
Screw it. Do this. Yeah, it's the it's the Famicom version, not the Game Boy version. Yep. Bloodlines is on there too. Which is really surprising. You can be playing Castlevania Bloodlines on the Switch or on the PS4. I think I'm going to get mine on the Switch. Then I can play them on, all on the road. faces ruin and despair. The world is changing, yet hope remains in the hearts of the people. We go about our daily lives never knowing the forces that can change our destinies forever. We are oblivious, ignorant like sheep to the slaughter. This night, in the year of our Lord 1047, marks the beginning of our journey together. A journey into darkness, into madness. I watch him from the shadows. Is he the one? He has come far already, but he will be tested, tested to the very limits of human endurance and beyond. This night he rides looking for the old gods, armed with an amulet that has led him here. Tonight he will begin his journey into oblivion. The struggle for supremacy is eternal, inevitable. Victory is the natural objective of every creature on this world. They will kill and die for their kind to dominate. Some call this eternal struggle equilibrium, the balance between light and darkness. This is a test from God to strengthen our spirit. Perhaps this is true, or perhaps it is simply a pious lie. If it is true, darkness has come to engulf one's proud humanity, and we are witnessing the end of mankind. this game. Get some. Oh, oh, oh. give us, get some. Get some. Oh, get some.
What's up, Soulfly man? How you doing, buddy? Playing a lot of good Castlevania, dude. I'm playing a lot of good Castlevania games tonight. This one's amazing, dude. Watch. I didn't block that. Are they the same? No. They're, they have their... Dude, Haunted Castle is hardcore hard. It's not even fun it's that hard, dude. For real. If you think Cuphead is hard, you haven't played Haunted Castle, dude. It's ridiculous. find you in the forest show him your manhood who, who are you oh soulfly are you still here i gotta show you something i have traveled here seeking the guardian of the lake you are from the order they sent you how do i find them he he will find you 
in the forest. Your ride's dead. Looks like you're hoofing it, man. And now his journey begins. Gabriel, Gabriel Belmont. him into the old forest watching him from afar he is strong indeed the one god comes to drive out the many but here in this place so flies not here anymore is thin and threadbare the old god still holds sway here few venture this far into the wood he is disturbed by dreams dreams that gnaw at his very soul he will rest for the night but rest will not come easy the battle has left him weakened, but he knows the dream will return, and though he fears nothing on this earth, yet his nightmares sap the strength within him and leave a cold grip on his heart. Tomorrow he will use the old hunting path. Long has it been in disuse, but for now, he dreams. Heart reminds me of Dante's Inferno. What motivates a man to confront the challenges that most of us would run from? Condemning him to solitude, exposing him to defeat and death. The answer is love, a force so powerful that all reason becomes blind to it blind to all things, even the truth. The truth. Loss of love can make a man desperate, desperate enough to do anything to bury the truth, to hide from its pain. Pony, oh shit. shit. Do that thing with your tongue again. Hurry. There's a ward on your ass. Shit, I fell.
All right, let's try that again. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Get some. He's good. Oh boy. No. Oh, whoa, whoa. Easy, easy. Whoa, look out. Oh, I'm almost dead. Oh, damn, I did die. Quite a few, man. There's quite a few. Walking through the woods. <laughs> New combos available. Digger wave.
alone again with only his thoughts as company, he continues on his journey to find the one he seeks. Who or what was that strange creature? There is a power here that few know, a power that could have some influence on events. Perhaps the guardian of the lake is aware of him now and offers aid in his quest. There is just the small matter of the dead bog to overcome, a place that has claimed the lives of many of the Brotherhood. The smell of death is strong here, and danger lies around every corner, but nothing will stop him. Nothing will stand in his way. This game's awesome looking, dude. Like, I really wish they would, uh, bring this back on the PS4 and the Xbox One with 60 frames per second, dude. For real. That's what I want. the goblins goblin bomb Get him. I'll swallow your soul. Uh, happy 420, uh, everybody. And it's a Castlevania marathon. Did you see my new lamp, uh, Soulfly? Yeah, I see it, dude.
Check it out, man. I'm over five hours in. I played a lot of good Castlevania games tonight. I'm going to play a little bit more and then call it a night. And no, I don't want to skip that cutscene. This is where I came from. Yeah, on mine, uh, on 360, I have all the DLC, and you can do all kinds of shit. You have to, if you play Lords of Shadow, you have to play the DLC. That's, a, that's what kind of sucks. But you have to. It's, like, key for the storyline. Oh, man. But, yeah, a good Castlevania night, for sure. But I'm ready to call it. I would have liked to have gotten enough people together for Friday 13th, but if we didn't have enough people, I didn't even bother trying. Maybe sometime, though. Uh, tomorrow night, I'm thinking... 
either Silent Hill or some Mega Man 11. What do you think, you guys? But yeah, I'm, I'm excited for the uh, Castlevania bundle. I'm going to get it even though I have every one of those games. Except for Kid Dracula for Famicom. You say Silent Hill. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Let me turn off this sex box. I was playing that on the Xbox One. That's why I would have to start all of those games from scratch and there's a lot of shit to uh, do in Lords of Shadow that is a big 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 game very big game so we got Ty Silent Hill Mega Man 11 we'll let fate decide alright well let's jam out a little bit I'll do a fatality and uh, say adieu Before I played the original Doom.
Castlevania stream, so I'm gonna leave it off with some good Castlevania tunes instead of my normal outro. So here we go.